Assuming an inflation rate of 2% per year, what was the change in welfare spending over the period in real terms as a percentage of spending in 2006? So, for welfare, we're looking at this region here, in 2006, we need to apply this inflation rate per year to this spending to see what this money is actually worth in 2016. So, if we take this, 491.8 billion, that's our starting point, and we need to increase by 2% per year. That's a multiplier of 1.02. If we're doing this for 10 years, from 2006 to 2016, we raise that multiplier to the power 10 for 10 years. That gives us an adjusted value of 599.5 billion. So that's our 2006 adjusted total, essentially what that money is worth now in 2016 due to inflation. Now let's calculate the total spending on welfare for 2006 and 2016 based on these new figures. So 2006, we've got 16% of the spending was on welfare, that's 0.16 as a multiplier, multiplied by the new value of the money in 2016, which gives us 95.92 billion. For 2016, we have a 9% share, 0 0.09, of the 606.6 billion, which is 54.59. So we're looking for the change in welfare spending, that's the difference between these numbers. So we'll take one away from the other to give us a fall of 41.33 billion. So the last thing we need to do is express that as a percentage of spending on welfare in 2006. This is our real terms change, 41.33. That's a decrease, so we're going to make that negative. We need to divide that by the welfare spending in 2006, the actual welfare spending. 16%, which is 0 0.16, of the total, which is 491.8 billion. Then we multiply by 100 to express as a percentage, which gives us a 52.5% decrease, which is answer 1.